Uh, guys, welcome back to Let's Play More Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. So, I waited by the fire. Um, let's see if we can get this done here. Uh, looks like I have to wait till a specific time. This is a shame. Specific time of day. It must not be noon. Uh, well, it's it's actually it's working. Um, let's just wait. You can see my shadows moving. Work it, son. Hoping it's the right. Uh, it looks like it's yeah. It looks like it's doing it. And I just gotta be patient. can say is this better be the right way to do this. No! Or do I have to make it bigger? Oh, please don't tell me I have to do that. Oh, please don't tell me. I have to wait again. Go away, stupid. Alright, let's see if this will work. Oh, so close! I just need a little bit bigger. No! Oh, this failed. Failed on so many levels. Rivali's Gale is now ready. Here's another one, though, I can use. I should have known. Big enough. Oh, come on. <laughs> this should work. How big does it have to be? Now I use it. Do I have another? No, I don't. So now what do I do? This is a total disaster. Oh, I didn't realize it had to be glowing. Oh, well. At, there's only three snowballs that you get? Really? They kept breaking on me. It's not fair. Oh. So, does this mean I have to, like... Maybe I should just... 
man. Okay, well, if I have to do it, I have to do it again. Um, I think I'll just, like, teleport. Let's teleport, um... I don't know, where would we need to go? To the tower? Be like far enough away. <laughs> well, let's see what we can do. I think you can see what I mean about there being a lot more colder places, like a lot more colder climates than warm, hot climates. So, like even during the night, the desert is cold, right? It's only during the day that you'd need the heat resistant stuff. I just hope that they, they it'll respawn. If I go far enough away and come back, I think it would. One more Revali scale left. I should probably see what's at the top of that anyways. That guy's not alive, is he? I'll definitely have to wait um, again. see what's here. <laughs>
Well, there's a Korok here, at least. Um, over here, it looks like it needs to go. about you guys. <laughs> Who knows, maybe by the time I get back up there it'll be time again. For this to all work out. Those snowballs better be back. That's all I gotta say. my cold clothes. <laughs> Looks like there could be something over here too. these ice keys wings. I'm gonna need them. Okay, well, there's some more snowballs up here. Wait a minute. This... Oh. I was like, do I have to do something with the snowballs? No, it doesn't look like it. Wait, there's a shrine over... Is that the... What? Huh? Okay. Like there's two shrines I'll be able to to get. How do I do that again? I don't know. Let's just... Get this done. If there is no, uh... Snowballs here, then I know where to get them. Okay, looks like they are here again. 
Okay, so let's do this again. Stay till noon. I thought it had to be big, but I guess not. Okay, what was it? It was around like 3 o'clock or something. I think it was. So. Now we wait. I might as well, uh, get one of these bigger, I guess. Yep. Since I thought that's what it was all about. <laughs> Should be big enough, right? Okay. Get out of my way. These other ones prepared just in case I mess up. Yeah. Not taking any more chances. I'll be able to over get that other one too that I saw. Uh oh. No. Oh, whatever. That one can break for all I care. Time was this gonna go? Wait, is this is it that's too big to carry now? Oh, you gotta be kidding me. Oh, <laughs> I'm gonna fail this a second time. I refuse. Okay. Let's take this one. I'm not gonna throw it. Let's just hope I don't miss it. The time window. Oh, 
Okay, it's still open. Good. There, perfect. Okay, good. Thank goodness. Finally. Must be like 4.30 around that time it starts. Now I'm trying to think. Is there any other shrines here? What item? Moonlight scimitar. Was about to bust, anyways. Got that one, and now let's head out over to this shrine that I saw. Also, I should get the one that's on the Gerudo uh, tower. It's near there. doing? Huh? Who are you? Who are you? Hey, my name is Moza. I'm trying to perfect my ultimate dish, so I'm training in isolation right now. Mm -hmm. Smoke signal. Oh, you into smoke? This is not a smoke signal, as you can plainly see I'm in the middle of cooking. It's burning. Badly. <laughs> it's, I'm burning it? So then you're saying I messed it up, I see. So for some reason, no matter how hard I try to cook something wonderful, it always turns out badly. I thought of this ultimate recipe myself, too. Why is this happening? Teach me a recipe. Oh. I would love to. I don't mind at all. I'm sure you'll be able to cook something really tasty. I mean, probably. I have a recipe for a lavish meat dish, an ancient uh, meat dish, and an ultimate survival dish. Which will you learn? Uh, I don't... Ancient meat <laughs> dish? Sure thing, I'll probably teach you the recipe for my ancient meat dish. First, prefer the meat you want to use. I recommend either bird meat or steak. Then you'll cook it with something from a broken guardian. An ancient part. That sounds gross. Hey, that's not nice. Cooking delicious meat with something that smacks a history is the only way. How else would one create an ancient meat dish the likes of which no one has ever seen before? <laughs> to be honest, what I always end up making is dubious food. Though I don't see what's so dubious about it. 
even when I use ingredients I'm certain will be perfect. There are lots of times I still mess up. Cooking is complicated. Do you want to hear another recipe? It's a lavish one. Uh, I recommend either bring me, yeah, and then you'll toss some nice fresh ore. That sounds great. <laughs> Cooking delicious meat with shiny ore is the only way. How else would make? Uh, how else would one create a truly lavish meat dish? Silly. To be honest, what I always end up making is rock hard food. How did it even get that rocky anyway? <laughs> uh, ultimate survival <laughs> dish. Okay, first you have to uh, defeat a monster. After that, you'll find yourself a cooking pot and toss in tons of monster parts. That sounds ah. gross. In order to survive out in the wild, you've got to be willing to eat anything. That's the idea behind my ultimate survival dish. You may end up with nothing at, to eat but dubious food, but I won't achieve my goals unless I make some sacrifices. I don't see what's so dubious about using monster parts, though. You know, when I use ingredients, I'm certain will be perfect. Yeah. Okay. Nope. That was kind of funny. Alright, so let's get this shrine out of the way. I want to, um... Okay, I still got some time. Bravery's Grasp. Oh, okay, yeah, I remember this one. Yep. Okay, for the longest time, I had no idea, but you can pick these things up. <laughs> and what you need to do is put it on this thing. And then it'll keep hitting the uh, switch. Is it not hitting it anymore? It's not hitting it. What the heck? Oh, it like moves around on it. No, oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I tried to do this a whole bunch of different ways when I first tried this shrine. Like I said, I had no idea you could pick up that laser. Like, I knew you could, uh, stop them. But that wasn't gonna help me. And there's yet another shrine, too. Um, like I said, by the Gudo Tower, you have to wait certain time of day there too <laughs> I 
like to think all these, like, all this is, like, a result of her, like, horrendous cooking. <laughs> she just keeps cooking and cooking. And it's all burnt out. See if I can get over there. See what's up at the top of this. been up here before. Talos boss? No. Couldn't be, could it? I think it might be. Maybe not. Yes, it is. Okay. I'll mark him on my map. Wait, what's that over there? Oh, that's another. Sh that's the shrine. Okay. All right. Um, let's let's get that shrine done over here. Gonna have to wait a while though. So that's probably gonna be it for this episode, guys. Uh, Godspeed. I'll wait till it's the correct time of day and then get it open. So that'll be it for this episode. Godspeed. Stay frosty. God.